Fair has a regular local council development area of the Equest Division in Lagos State for the 2022 Annual Kiddies Fun Fair Party. Organized by the LCDA chairman in collaboration with his wife, Mrs. Oyin Akiloye. This is Christmas time, of course, and it's an annual festive period that commemorates the birth of our Lord Jesus Christ. It's a period of celebration, it's a period to rejoice, and it's a period of giving back to the society. This year's annual festive period promises to be a fun filled event as there will be a lot of cash donations, cash prizes, and gifts for all the children in attendance. It promises to be memorable, it promises to be thrilling, it promises to be fun for all the children here at the Radio LCDA. And of course, Echo Hot Blog is here to give you details of the event as it unfolds. I am Akangwe Felua. Just stay with us. See, I don't ask now. I don't know what to do. Mary, do you know that your baby boy would kiss eye to a blind man? Mary, do you know that your baby boy would come the star with his hand? Did you know that your baby boy has walked where angels strong? Wow. When you kiss your little baby, you kiss the face of God. Christmas is a period of celebration a period to commemorate the birth of Jesus Christ, a period of giving, and most significantly, a period of beehive of activities to mark the event. It is therefore not surprising that Eredo Local Council Development Area, LCDA, in Lagos State, celebrated its annual Christmas Fun Fair Kiddies Party at the Council Secretariat in Ekwe on December 20th, 2022, in grand style. The event was filled with exciting activities like quiz competitions, raffle ticket prizes, cash prizes and donations to the widows in the Eredo community. The Council Chairman Honorable Ismail underscored the significance of hosting the Kiddies Fun Fair, which he said had gone beyond mere fun, with the inclusion of programs such as quizzes, spelling bee and many more cognitive and psychomotor inclined ones. It gives me joy and indeed humility to welcome you to 2022 Kiddies Fun Fair. This is no doubt a second edition since inception of our administration in Eredo LCDA. This year fun fair has gone beyond a mere fun. This become another function that most of the people are interested in to participate. This year edition includes quick quiz, competition, varieties of shows, exhibitions, swing and many more similar fun activities. Unfortunately, most parents do not consider this event important for their children 
and prefer them to stay at home. They do not realize that these events can have positive impacts on their children and can help them to be a good person and effective member of society. I affirm that Children's Home Fear is a good source for your child to, sense, to socialize with other children. At Home Fear, children get to participate in various of activities. They can act in children's play, participate in puppet show or dance in various programs. Happy to mention that children are young and beautiful creatures with their innocent smile and carefree spirit. They steal the heart of many. Little wonder that our administration in the Radio LCD set aside this day to celebrate our loving kids so that the Fun Fair shall provide a wide area for expressing and providing their talent. Permit me to appreciate our caring, loving parents and teachers who sacrifice their time in order to be with the children and celebrate with them. I pray to your I pray that your labor shall not be in vain. After that, the wife of the chairperson of the Eredo LCDA, the convener of the program, Ismail Christiana, in her opening speech implored the kids to pursue noble academic excellence. She also decried the trend of deadly acts of social vices perpetrated in the area and appealed for abstinence. It is disheartening to note the alarming rate of brutal killings among the youths who are potential leaders of our great country, Nigeria. Your parents love you. Our country, Nigeria, needs you. Do not kill your future dreams. Say no to cultism, rape, vulgarism, and other social vices that could destroy your bright future. Mrs. Ismail also urged parents to take full responsibility for the upbringing of their children. I want to appeal to our parents to take full responsibilities of the up upbringing of their children and was to eradicate, eradicate the social ills in our society. To our religious leaders, I equally appeal to you to preach love, tolerance, and peaceful existence in all religions in all religious centers for a better Nigeria. Mrs. Ismail further reiterated the commitment of the Mansuru Ismail led administration to the welfare of widows and the elderly, noting that the sum of 10,000 naira had been prepared for hundreds of widows across boards in the LCDA. May I also use this medium to reflect the commitment of this administration to the welfare of our widows and elderly. In this wise, we shall here today give a sum of 10,000 naira each to. 100 widows and elderly in the LCD. After that, different fun field activities began as the children engaged in dance competition, hide and seek, music lip sync games, as well as quiz and spelling bee competition. <laughs> Bend down. Bend, bend down. Bend down. Uh -huh. Now crawl. Go and come on. Crawl. Action crawl. Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen. Go down. 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 Go Oh no. Ah, 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 
Primary School emerged as the winner of the quiz competition, while RCM Primary School Ajigbende got the second and third position respectively. The name of America's president. Who knows it? Nobody. Thank you. You can go. A round of applause. Choose a question. And I'll say Choose another one. Number eight. Who is the vice chairman of Herede LCD? Vice chairman. Thank you. Next. Wait. Bye bye. Bye bye. Choose a question. Number two. Number two. Which country won the World Cup in 2022? Which country wants to work on? What do? Thank you. Bye bye. <laughs> the features that help an organism to fit and survive in habitat is dash A habitat, B place, C adaptation. Final answer. Final answer. Correct. Thereafter. The sum of 10,000 Naira was donated to 100 widows and aged people in the community. The presentation was done by APC Apex leader Eredo LCDA, Honorable Tolani Wasiu Adeyemi, accompanied by Eredo chairman Mr. Ismail Monsuru and his wife Mrs. Ismail Christiana. <laughs> the winner of the raffle draw ticket was gifted a brand new industrial grinding machine Honorable Tolani, in his interview with a cohort blog, advised the children to always adhere to instructions and also be up and doing at all times. Yeah, I want them to feel happy 
to always adhere to everything that is good. They should not waste their time doing unhealthy things. They have to be up and doing every time. A cohort blog interviewed a number of the kids and parents present at the event. That God should continue to keep them. They is done to do this kind of thing every year. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. The chairman of the and the and the vice chairman of the my family, my mom and my dad and my sister. I want to wish people happy. Merry Christmas, the chairman and the chairperson. I want to tell them Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. I want to wish uh, my teachers, uh, I want to wish the chairman of the radio Merry Christmas. In fact, I'm really happy for today's program. I really appreciate the chairman of Eredo ICD and his wife. I really appreciate them for what they have done for our children today. We really actually give big thanks to them. Next year is going to be sweet more than this, inshallah. By the grace of Almighty, I will be here in the name of Allah. To the child, ma, I want to wish a Merry Christmas. Enjoyable, ma. Enjoyable. I want to wish the chairman um, happy. Happy New Year and Happy Christmas Day. That they, uh, uh, did a great job bringing us here. Uh, I, I, I want to thank him for making this day come. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Happy New Year and Happy Merry Christmas in advance. A big thanks to them and a Merry Christmas. Uh, thank you for taking care of me. I want to tell them a very big thank you. I am very, very happy. I can't even express my emotions right now because I wasn't expecting this. I did not see it coming. Besides, I call myself lucky today. And I, I think I am so fortunate to have this privilege, this opportunity to receive this uh, precious gift today because I wasn't seeing it coming. So I use this medium to thank the chairman, Honorable Ismail Mosso, Akiloye. Because I was here last year, and thank God, to God be the glory that I am here again today. I came here with empty hands, but so lucky I have that I have taken a tangible gift today. So, but God in his infinite mercy, Continue to spread us, Mr. Ismail. And I will Ismail. God, God should replenish his boss from where he took this money to buy this tangible gift today. May God, may God bless and abide with his household, his wife, and his children. May God continue to take him to places, to higher places in life. Meanwhile, Student of Scholars International Secondary School in Mokun and Redeemed Christian Church of God RCCG PDG Parish entertained the audience with choreography and dance performances. <laughs> On Scholars International School. Ladies and gentlemen, I use this video to recognize the top media station and outreach in the space. Ladies and gentlemen, I recognize the president of the Lagos Group. Ladies and gentlemen, I also recognize the president of the Lagos Group.
My message for our parents is to take care of their kids so they can be a leader tomorrow. They can be a great people, person tomorrow in the society. And you know, we are the yelling tide season. We have to bring all our children together. We have to celebrate them. You know, they are worth celebrating. They are the leaders of tomorrow. So, you know, in to complement what the Lagos the government is doing, if you go to LTV now, you see so many of the children there. Look, Lagos the government is celebrating them. And of course, I am, I am, one part, I am part of the Lagos State the government of Beachers. So that's why we are bringing all our children together to celebrate them. We need to encourage them. We need to let them know that they are the future, they are the future of tomorrow. You know, children, they are like flowers. You need, you need to do some sacrifice. You know, parents, my advice to parents is that they should take very good care of their words. Children, they are like flowers. You have to water them. You have to trim it. You have to do so many sacrifices. So they should take very good care of their children. Most importantly, they should take their education. Very, very important. You know, when the foundation is not good, it might not bring a very good result. But if the foundation is solid from the start, more especially the elementary, primary school, they should take very cognizant, good cognizance of it so that we can, we, they can get the best out of them. By special grace of God, is an annual event. We did the second edition since the since our inception, and we are not going to stop at this. It's going to be a continuous exercise. And you know, um, LTV, LTV, eight, they were here last year, and they can compare and contrast last year activities and the one we are doing today. There is a increase improvement and the one we are going to do next year is going to be better I mean, what is important is that we have um, a whole full year they are engaged in ed educational jo um, things in school they've gone to school first term second term third term but all through the year they need to relax they need to have um, an atmosphere to relax and feel celebrated for the success achieved during the educational period in school. So we have to come together, celebrate them, show to them that we love them as parents. As a government, we love them. So we have to call them together to celebrate with them. Let's For the children, we know we are in the, like uh, we know we're an era that children are really computer literate. The computer is actually for a good purpose and also for a bad purpose. So to, to the children, I will tell them to learn the good things from the computer, to solve the web, to add values to themselves through the computer, not, the, not to demoralize themselves by watching pornography and all the rest of it. They should click to the good parts of the computer. And to the parents, we know the, the rate at which the children are growing, they are growing faster than us. We cannot compare the era we had. So we also have to get ourselves knowledgeable. We have, we have to learn of the things that the, the children are learning today. So we are able to keep them in the right track. We should monitor them at all times. We didn't just bring them to this world to fend for themselves. We have to keep, we have to keep watching over them, guiding them in the right path. The event was well attended by Eredo LCDA Vice Chairman Mrs. Stella Dolakbo, the executive and legislative arm of Eredo LCDA, as well as Ecosi Ejiri LCDA Chairperson Mrs. Shiduade Anomo, amongst others. <laughs>
parents here with all the children at the Eredo LCDA. Our kids are our treasure. We should always treasure them with whatever we have. And this is where we appraise the LCDA chairman and his wife, Mrs. Oni Akiloye, for making this event one of its kind. This is Echo Hospital reporting. Do well to follow us on all our social media platforms. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. I've been back. I can go a Have a wonderful celebration. Bye.